Stephen, our first home win of the season. It's a big Dublin Derby win from the Basalde Hotel. How much did everyone enjoy that? Oh, we know Dublin Derbies are special, and especially tonight when you consider we've over 10,000 in the ground. It's the first time. Uh, it was a special occasion, and I think that probably affected our performance a little in the first half, to be honest. But at our second half, we were, we were outstanding and, and could have won the game by more, to be honest. Yeah, did you feel we did make a slow start to the game and it was a bit cagey at times in the early stages? Yeah, we were just second guessing what we were doing. We were, we were slow, we weren't seeing the spaces quick enough and we were making the wrong decision. And uh, sometimes that happens when you have a big build up to a game and everything's talking about the, the biggest attendance in the league for a long time and sometimes that can have an effect and maybe that played a part in it. But I thought second half, the, like I said, I thought the players were, were really high level and what they'd done. We made a dream start after the second half with the two goals. What did you say to the lads in the dressing room? Because it seemed to work. Oh, we just showed them where, where they could really hurt them. Um, what we felt before the game, to be honest. Uh, the spaces were there. We knew they would press how they pressed. Um, but we just weren't seen in the first half quick enough. In the second half, we, we seen it a lot quicker, penetrated a lot quicker, and as a result, got opportunities. And, and the second half, we were excellent. Uh, Johnny was the hero two weeks ago in Galway and it uh, fell to him at the right time here again today and Dara Burns uh, takes his goal really well as, as well for 2-0. Yeah, I think Johnny's been very, very good. Uh, we've had to be careful with him because he's, he's obviously off the back of an operation and but um, he's worked extremely hard. He came in last week, scores and, and tonight I thought he was very good. His energy, his press, he could have had another one um, and Dara Burns was, was really good again. Aaron Green pogged home uh, goal number three shortly after you introduced him. And I mentioned to um, Nudger as well, he had a, an immense second half. I thought Darren Nugent was, was the best player on the pitch, to be honest. I thought he, was, he covered every, every blade of grass. He played in three different positions for us tonight. We asked different things of him in them positions, and he, he, was, uh, he was top level. Uh, Darren's one that's gone away, done his work, uh, had two loan spells come back and, and you can see how much he's grown, how much uh, he brings to the team and yeah, I thought he was the best player on the pitch tonight. It's good to get Trevor Clark back on the pitch after his injury but uh, no Rory Gaffney in the squad, is that an injury for Rory? Yeah, Rory picked up a knock in Sligo and he played with it against Galway and it just hasn't settled, shouldn't be too bad, uh, we might look at Monday um, and if not, definitely uh, St Pat's next week, hopefully Jack is similar and then Aaron, Sean and Neil will be a little bit after that. You played in the first game in Tata 15 years ago. You can go back even further than that. You remember when this pitch was just an empty field. Today we had over 10,000 in the stadium with four stands. This day is, is historic. That's incredible. And I said yesterday uh, there's so many people connected with the club that need to take uh, credit for what they've done throughout the years to get to this point. Um, but it just shows the potential this club has. Um, and the league, uh, but this club, and I think we've got to make sure we have more uh, solo signs up around Tyler for the rest of the season. Um, because, like I said, um, a lot of people have put so much into it, get to this point. Now we need to build, and we can't rest. We need to be rootless, and we need to be hungry, and we need to go again. With the win in Galway and the win tonight, we can take confidence going into Waterford Easter Monday. Yeah, the group have been good. These players don't get flustered uh, on results. The more um, on performances, um, so th we know they've been good. Uh, we scored three tonight. I think that's been coming for a number of weeks, to be honest. Um, but like I said, they're in a good place. We just need to stay focused, keep improving. And uh, I think what's that? Our sixth game or seventh game? We're only early, but just keep focused, keep improving, and let's see where it takes us. Stephen, well done. Cheers. Thank you.